What parameters do you run your ponds at? pH, AH, TDS. I understand you charge large amount of water in your ponds. Do you keep good KH when feeding lots of food? No, KH is the main thing that we monitor. Uh, don't monitor uh, TDS. Often uh, pH, we're running pretty neutral around 7.5. Uh, that will slide a little bit if we're not on top of the KH all that much. With the extreme feeding levels, we do burn KH crazy, so, but we are constantly buffering uh, and bringing that back up, uh, which does pretty much keep the pH in sync uh, most of the time. So, But for me, KH is one that's probably not spoke about enough. It is the glue of the entire system. And, and if we know we've got KH, for me, I like stable minimum of three, uh, upwards stable being the the big word there but minimum of three and beyond uh and yeah that's that's sort of where that's at for me uh tds is one i've just got no sort of time for for monitoring to be fair uh and yeah the results you know it's not something i check and the results were clear for everyone to see in the video uh, i just posted there and that's like going into its second year and no doubt if i kept that fish same pond for another year i've actually now sold it but another year uh that would be cracking on i think in this next season 75 to 77 somewhere around that because the growth has been so explosive in the past two seasons so uh yeah for me you know more people need to pay attention to kh because more often than not when there are instabilities and problems in a system uh you can find that kh hasn't been monitored or buffered or, or looked after because it, it does pin so much uh, together.